all new at six, an emotional reunion for a COVID patient and the doctors and nurses who saved his life. This guy was in the hospital for almost a month. Now he's warning everyone to get that vaccine so nobody goes through what he went through. News 6's James Barbero has his story. The cheering staff at Health First says the man walking into the room was the hospital chain's first COVID patient and survivor. You remember me, I don't really remember you. Mark Twentyman was in a medically induced coma, so the 69-year-old says he can't remember his 29-day stay at Cape Canaveral Hospital or the staff he credits with saving his life. It's so nice to see you. So 13 months later, Mark returns to the hospital to thank his heroes. To see him here today, walking in and talking, is amazing. Good seeing you again. Long before a vaccine was available, Mark says the hospital used plasma to keep him alive. It was shipped all the way from Pennsylvania as Mark fought for his life. And the staff really came together as a group and a team. I think every associate in the ICU had a hand in caring for him. Thanks to uh, the Cape Canaveral staff for not giving up on me. Mark says he never thought he'd be able to stand again the way he is today. His outlook is much more positive now. Since his recovery, he says he's received all his vaccines. My message is, if you have any reason for hesitating, uh, read my story if you can get a hold of it. Mark stays in Coco for the winter, so after meeting his lifesavers today, he says he's ready to go back home to New York with a lot of gratitude and with peace of mind. In Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, Getting Results News 6.